Welcome back folks, welcome back to Total Warhammer. I'm Black Templar, let's get on with this. Right guys, as you remember from the last video, I'm still recovering with this guy, and also Bull is making his way back to, um, you know, back to the, to the rest of the group. And Scrag is still recovering by making a force. Unfortunately, I couldn't get a all of the because, well, the Praetorians got there before I did. So, that's the state of play. Now, I am going to go and try and take this out, but it will take some time. Do an upgrade. Uh, nope. Nope. This thing what needs upgrade, Dean. I don't think there's many builds that need updating. Big name available. Don't need that. So we're pretty much stuck, guys. We can't move really until um until we have enough um you know until I have my force ready and hopefully we can gank on the what else. What else are going to be a tough opponent, I'll be honest, guys. I've said in the last video that they're going to be the one worst opponents to deal with. The Wild Hunt's one of the worst ones. I mean, some might see the Vampire Massacre, my, what, the, the English, the Vampire and the Horde one are bad. But to be honest, I took on the Horde one with ease. And the Vampire one isn't too bad. It's just, this one's worse because what else naturally are nasty. Wind of Pain. Okay. Well, I can't do anything in Belagar. I would rather keep them there for now until we can tell my army is ready. I mean, it sucks that I can't get um, the Bretonians to ally yet because at the moment I don't have the money or the resources. And I ain't giving up a star half a Stalia because I need that. Scroke, what do you want? Well, you're not at war with any people I'm with. So, I don't mind getting the money because, well, Skrook's over there, but also I get to see what he's up to, and now I can see what he's up to. A little bit of, um, espionage, shall we say. Oops, I forgot to move you, bull. So, bull's on his way. He should be there in a couple of turns. Where's Orion in all this? There he is. He's going to be the biggest threat. But if I'm smart about this, I could have all three of my Uga faction come crashing in and try and take out a couple of their settlements. Unless, um, you know, Grudge Bearer decides to show up and join in the fun. Golden no Oh, it's the, the Cold of Sigma. What do these guys want? Ambush discovered. And they got killed. Okay, um... There yet, and you still being built. There we go. You level up, so they all can be leveled. Let's see. By the light of the lady, you asked for a boon. Speak, and I will see if it is within my power to give. 
So what would you do if you want to fight them? Hmm. Not enough, huh? So let's have a try. I think I'm going to have to have a dick's amount of money to get him to do that fight. Because if I can just get one more ally to take on the what else, it will give me a chance to keep Orion off my back. Then I can focus a full skill barrage in the Southern Lands. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna capture King's Glaive. Hmm. Yep, because well, they're not near me, so they can argue as much as they like. I've got my own personal war. The cult of pleasures, the highest reigning power. Right, they're moving, good. Ooh, that Bellagon are on the move. You go ahead while they get ready. What? To the wisdom of Valea. Hmm. Are they going for um Whoa. When did they get an army? If we could just take out a couple of their settlements. We should be having enough power to put them out, but it's just getting that. It's Orion is the biggest threat, guys, because Orion is an absolute beast. I mean, Belagor, I could easily attack him, but I don't want to anger Grudgebearer, so I want to keep Grudgebearer happy. Right of Awakening. Oh, they took it! Oh, well, this changes the ball game. Okay. I do you wish the lady's favor? I will. Okay. Now join that and I'll help you with that. Oh, it's not a fair contest. Let's have a look at this. So he's willing to join that war. You asked for a boon. Speak, and I will see if it is within my So power. he wants he was willing to join them wars. But um uh, why is he not want to join with the You asked for a boon. Speak, and I will see if it is within my power to give. 40 bloody hell. That's That's kind of steep. I can't do that. Ooh, that's steep. Normally, guys, when that is that steep, it's usually in the case that it m you must require a either a lot of money or a lot of territory to give. But foo, the fact that yeah, he's asking that high, it's that it must be a ridiculous amount of money I'm going to need to even make him decide to fight the Wood Elves. However, Belagar's already got there and he's already started proceedings now if Belagar is able to hold out for just two turns so I can get there and back him up hmm Okay. So I'm stuck fighting them, but... Right, um... They haven't took it back. But they're coming in now, so... 
Okay, so Right, so now that I've mustered my force and they're on their way. I mean I could make another army, but I think it's best I don't. It's just in case if something goes horribly wrong, I can quickly replenish. I mean we are reaching the end game, guys. We are reaching the end game. So one way or another, this is going to end. I don't mind that. Empires went ranked 12. Oof, they must have been hit hard. The Awakening. Spring Returnal. Oh, hell no. I'm not fighting Gelt. He's been a good friend of mine. I'm not fighting him. Right. Move this way. <laughs> Sorry about that. Right. We are moving now. The war is about to happen. Now, if we can get a, if we can get a, get rid of like the Oak of Ages, we could use that to our advantage. I could give that to King Luan and say, right, go on then, attack the Bretonians, and they will come to me. You see, guys, I'm being smart here because I'm I'm kind of taking a page out of Greece's book, you know, buying allies and all that, but kind of works. That's why Greece is one of the richest ogres. Uh, that's you're not my problem, Festus. Ooh. Okay, what could you get this one? Oh, I'll have that. For all of us. An affront to Orion. On your feet. Bed down and eat up. Want everything. Only loot. I'm only going it slow because. There we go. Got a massive army. Now, if they take King's Glade. Oh, hell, Belagar. Meanwhile, up there, they're getting pushed back, which is good. Air from the Grim. Didn't expect to see you. Yep, I don't mind. Like I said, I've got no interest in fighting Dark Elves. It's what else I've got a problem with. And I would like to deal with them. I mean, in the next playthrough of this I'm going to do, I'll have my fill, my fill of bloody Dark Elves. Don't worry about that. I'll have my fill of those buggers. Oh, the Sword of Cain has been returned. So the sword begins. Follow the force. Biggest star in the world. I will. I will. I will. Fight them. Yeah, moved away. So the Oak of Ages is up for grabs. And he wants to go to the Crag Hall of Frodo. To war. What do you want? 
best for some help on. What? Oh, you. Oh, it's the. I don't want you guys. Yeah, you go there. <laughs> what? I'm being sneaky right now for um Opportunity friends. Can I get him to fight Champion of the Lady? Let the supplicant come forward. Okay. Pay. Wow. Yeah, that's what happened. Looks like looks like I'm gonna have to do this the hard way. And by hard way, sneaky. Cause I'm gonna if I could just capture one of these and give them to Luan, that means it will force the um Okay um Ooh, spices. Okay, that's going nothing there, nothing there. Um, no, I don't want that. That will do. Go with that one. Okay, that's that. It's just typical of chaos. They always interrupt. Tyrion. Yeah, I don't mind a non-aggression pack. Don't mind at all. You can have your non-aggression pack because, like I said, I have no interest in what's going on over there. And I have no interest in what's going on in the East. The widows are my concern, and that's what I'm sticking to. Now, will they attack? They haven't yet. Federation. Close victory. Loot and occupy, but I don't want this. So, what are you? Do you wish the lady's favor? Oh, you want that? Oh. What's monstrous? You want? Ugh, no, no, no. Okay, you don't want it. Um. Will you want it? Greetings, honorable ally. Um, which one's this one again? Oak of Ages. You don't want it. Who wants the Oak of Ages? I'm trying to give someone the Oak of Ages is going to be a nightmare. Can I assist? Bretonia is patient when listening and. Um. <laughs> you don't have to get snappy. I stand the far step forth, true friend of the Undone clan. No, uh, help. Looks like nobody wants it. Well, that's a problem. 
I was hoping that one would want it, but they probably don't want it. Um, let's see. Lovely jubbly. Well, since it's... Um, good with that. Just, uh... Okay. And I think my camp is the one that's... Upgrade. Is it this camp? No, it's not. It's the other one. It is. There we go. While well, that's going. If we could just get one of them. If we could just give it a couple of their armies. Aurelian. Surprised to hear you in this. I don't mind. Non-aggression packs. Like I said. I have no problem with what's going on over there. You guys can just beat the crap out of each other. Now, I know for a fact um, Orion and them will probably attack me or they'll just do nothing. We'll see what happens. Like, this has become a cagey warfare. I can't go all reversing. Oh! A Pyrrhic victory. I'll lose the many and gorgeous from that army. I'll take that because that means extra money, but I think we'll go with I'm replaced. But that's a massive army they just lost. Now I can go on the attack. But who's. Oh, he's took the hit. So. So, hold on. Fill your belly. Obey me or you're dead. And what else is missing from this group? Oh, yes, Sam. Um, where are you? So, you're going to take a while. You're in a worse state. But you can continue on with your attacks. There we go. We got another one. Um, let's see, what gonna do with you? Um, you... Draftmaster and Quartermaster? Okay, um... I mean, I do need a lot of repairs after that fight. Um. So a few of them. I've still got me two Thunderers. Still got me. Two Gorges. And a Giant. So this will take a while for them to heal, because that was a battle. But, um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, now that they've lost their Orion and their biggest army, 
it's now practically now a question of when we get rid of them. But I have to wait for a while because I gotta recover. But Orion's forces will take a while to recover as well because that was a lot of stacks they just lost. Rank 17. Oh, thanks for the money. Gonna lose a lot, but to be honest, this was a just a cobble to give an army, so it's all mine. Biggest gap in the world. Ah, uh, let the supplicant come forward. So you don't want it. I was hoping at least some of you guys might want these. You want that? Alright. If you insist. Good. There we go. And finally, Vale of Avalon. There you go. Now he could deal with all the problems. Obey me. I mean, I'm like gonna lose that force. Can't hire anyone, so. No one else touches. A failure first force. What the? What happened there? Did something happen? I know some of you think this is a bit of a boring thing I'm doing, like just just doing all results. But to be honest, I'm not a big fan of doing what else settlement battles. Sure. Well, the fair guys, they were not going to survive. To be fair, I kind of expected it. Oh, he didn't take over it. Interesting choice. But at the same time, I can't expect it, guys. And it opened up to make another army. No. Oh, what's this? Ooh. Why not? Oh, huh. Your gifts are bountiful. The boss. Oh, you're recovered already? Nice. But it will take you a while to get up there, so crawl along a little bit. I need to get some, um... So we'll get make another lord. Intelligent or tough. Oh, tough would be nice. Uh, well, we got access to the camp, so... Actually... Outpost. Okay, the outpost. I'm looking for something that I could use, like... Mm, no... Mm. This looks prom. Oh, Pegasus Knights. Yes, I want them. 
I mean, if the battle ends before I get them, that's not a total waste. So he's stuck there recovering. If we can get, if they can chip away at them, I'll go and attack. This is all about now, the momentum. If any of them, will, well, I think they're about to die. And oh my good lord, look at the Karakskar forces are coming in. This is folk is pure diplomacy and a little green par palming and grease palming and kind of works well as a politician and a financier. Oh, Avalon failed. We had a couple of turns and they'll be ready. Um Right, what can we get from the dwarves? So, we have to wait a little bit, but... I think with the dwarves, I will only take two units, which will probably be the, um... The catapult and the cannon. So, they'll join that rank. Do what I say. And with the cannon near me, I'm gonna go with... Two giants and Ooh, um, two of them for now. Oh, hey, Tyrion. Trade agreement, no problem. It's coming, guys. The crescendo to this war is coming. But the question is... If I lose this battle, this final battle with them, it could end up me being pushed back for a long time to recover. But at the same time, if they lose, it's all over. And I've done too bad, actually. I've been quite um, the diplomatic opponent. Attack, then... Retreat and then still got a decent power. But that's a problem when you're fighting in the Wood Elves territory. It's a nightmare. Oh, they've been killed. Right. Did they die? Hmm. Let's see if I can catch them in an ambush. Time for a surprise, thief. It's a risk. <laughs> now, this is a risk what I'm doing, guys. But if I can catch one of them in an ambush, I could fight it. Right, so that's getting done. Um... Oh, you need something? Uh, yep. More meat for my grinder. They should be quickly out. Right, um. Like I said, this is a gamble, what I'm doing. But if I can ambush one of them into a fight, I could take one of them out. Because I got a feeling that they take out, if we take out some of their better units, better armies, we'll have a chance. But it's a question of, will I be lucky? Damn it, they seem from my ambush. So I would lose. Let's have a look. 
Armor piercing damage, obviously. Hmm. It's those dragons. It's it's a problem. I mean, I could fall back. And I mean, I could literally get in there quick and take out these, but these two dragons and a tree men. But these salts, ooh, they're a nasty bunch. Sisters of Fawns. I mean, they, I could probably take out on their own. But I think this is the main problem. Fall back. Can't believe they spotted me. Bloody ambush. Gets. Oh, hello. We may have caught a break. They've separated. That could be what we're waiting for. Valiant defeat. What do I miss? Oh, it's... I think these are the problems. So what is causing this? Take her out. Let's tag up. Oh, you picked the wrong place to go. Ho oh, ho, we got allies. Yeah, I'll take this fight. Wow, find the feet for that. Okay. Okay, so busy guys, we've got to hang on until our allies get here. But this could be good. Now that I've put them in a situation where they've got to fight me, now they don't have any allies to help. If this army falls, that's it. I think the, the Wood Elves are in big trouble. If I can get them with the... My crushers and these guys. And let the giants... They duke it out with the with the tree men. They should be able to take them out and give the dwarves time to get there. Oh, they're coming from behind. Oh, this could get ugly. Right, um, aim for them. I'm not going to move because I'm going to wait till my allies show up. Uh, them, not them. Good, good. You see, guys, the more of their units I try and, like, break. Woodland Rangers. Right 
when the dwarves come in, that's when I'll move. Time to move. Get them. Go after them. Okay, they're losing their Hawk Riders. But they're about to lose a lot more because here comes my Dwarven allies. They're running though. Where are they? Oh, they, they let us go? Big mistake. <laughs> Time to shoot these pigeons out the sky. Here they come. Oh wait, no. Don't let that dragon get away. Keep him down. Don't let that dragon get away. We need to kill it. What are you doing? We give it the frost dragons, the forest dragons. That's it. They're broken. But the dragons. Did we give it that one? Yeah, we got that one. That's good. That's good. We can't let that other dragon get away. And they're shattered. Decisive victory. They said close victory. Decisive, all right. But, ooh. Well, that army is now buggered because they've lost the dragon. The other one is pretty you know, dead. Their treatment is bashed up. Maybe their archers have pretty much gone. I mean, what have I lost? I've lost nothing, but I have taken a hell of a pounding. But they got a little overzealous and got caught. So you know what that means. 
This could be the, the deciding battle. Yep, she died in battle. Okay, what should we give you? And as for you... Yeah, but they are badly wounded. They'll have to take out. They'll have to be removed from the fight. And you, a couple of Pegasus knights, never hurts. <laughs> okay, so I think I'll buy a couple of gorges and bring me something good. And more cavalry. All right, you're getting made. <clears throat> But um, yeah, oh, oh, that was a massive catastrophe for them. They've lost one of their leaders. They lost two leaders and an arm and a very powerful army. What's that done to the power balance power? <clears throat> Wait for it. Come on. <clears throat> no. I'm not peace streaming you. Oh, hello. They've lost their minds. I think that's it, guys. You try to ambush me and it backfired. That's it, guys. It's over. And that's it. Tyrant all over. Players and all king of win a single player campaign. Nice. And that's it, guys. We've actually conquered the ogre, the world. Well, not conquered the world, but we actually got a lot of allies. We're ridiculously rich. And we've got enough food to last a lifetime. I would say that's a pretty good campaign for the Ogres. Don't you think? But yeah, that ambush was pretty much over, guys. There was no way they were going to win that fight now. It was as soon as that army died. And that ambush failed and got caught. It was over. It was pretty much over for them. Karakazul was my capital, huh? Eh, did not know that, but... As you can see, guys, I mean, look at this. That was when I did the mission. I mean, as the game progresses, ogres are slow to get going, guys. But trust me, to play the ogre kingdom effectively, you have to be smart about your camp placement. But also, you got to be smart on, you know, building relationships. I mean, I managed to get three dwarf clans on my side, the Empire, Guild, and a lot of the elves are on my side now. As well as the um, Mocha Bretonia. So I've kind of actually did more to bring world peace than anything else because of people are happy with me. I've allied with a lot of people. I mean, this is where we were seeing certain fights breaking out. And this was the, I think it was this, this was Gungor's territory. And the Gels was around here. Then we saw Gelt, we met him. Then we broke a peace treaty. You can see a lot of this is all about like battles and peace treaties. And I was doing a lot of recruiting. 
And then we had, um, I think for the the whole Bully Hounds War, that took a while, but it was pretty much we had to do it correctly. And then we had the war with the, with the Wood Elves. Like I said, the war with the Wood Elves was a cagey affair. It was back, forth, back, forth, smart attacking, fighting, and it was all about, you know, tactical maneuvering. Because I knew I couldn't go into a straight up punch fest. Because if I did go for a straight up punch fest, I would have lost. Because if you think about the Wood Elves guys, they're one of the strongest armies in the game. With all their tricks and their abilities. So the way I fought was the smart way to say, right, I can't beat you in a straight up fight. But they could. I kind of pulled a 4 on them saying, um, if you remember 4 um, Wrangler Rock where he goes to Hella. You can't defeat me, he says, no I can't. But he can. And <laughs> that's what I kind of did. I went, yeah, I can't beat you, what else? But they can. <laughs> I think as soon as they lost their main armies, that's when it was starting to disintegrate. And when Orion did that big attack, it was like, yeah, big mistake. Come on, I was not going to risk doing that. And it was for me with my sanity. But yeah, that is it for this... Um, playthrough i hope you enjoyed my little playthrough with the ogres if you like the videos please like share, subscribe ring the dinner bell and on and i'll see you in the next playthrough and i will probably do another total war video but it won't be for probably a little while i'm gonna be taking a little break from it while i focus on other projects so i will be back with another total war in the near future not too long probably a month or two anyhow i'll catch you later